The next function that I want to look at is the compare function. This is a really good function when you want to look at two words that are similar, like synonyms, but see how they're used differently. A classic example would be big and large. If I enter the word big, and then I type the word large, and then I put in my wild card for collocates. Then I can click compare words and see what type of words collocate with big and large. Uh, let's see. Let's check the settings we're looking. We're looking at frequency. Um, so let's change that to mutual information. Change to three like we did earlier. Now we'll click compare words and see what big collocates with compared to what large collocates with. Okay. So here we see big and here we have large. With big, we have examples like big brother, big surprise, big deal. And with large, we have large quantities, large amounts, large proportion. Just by looking at these, my first intuition would be that big maybe occurs more in a metaphorical sense, uh, while large occurs more in a literal sense, like an actual large skillet. Uh, meanwhile, we have things like big trouble. So it's not actually physical size, but more the idea, or the metaphor, the degree of trouble. Another thing we could do is look at, um, for example, run again. Now, what's the synonym of run? Maybe jog. So go for a jog and run, go for a run, or we can say go for a jog. Um, let's look at jog. <laughs> uh, so how are these two words different? Um, two words, even if they're synonyms, are always going to be used a little bit differently. Here we have the long, long run again. And in under jog, we have memory, memories, um, so things like memory are happening a lot with jog. Let's see what's happening there. We'll click on these for memory and see what we get. Okay. Here we have jog your memory, jog my memory. Um, so I brought someone along to jog your memory and a couple hundred might jog my memory. So we can see that we have a phrase like jog and then my, or your pronoun, and then memory. Uh, this will help us search for this. We could search for this on Google. Um, we could try to figure out what jog your memory means just based on these examples or do other searches. But the important thing is that we found a nice phrase with jog and memory to see how these work in natural language. So these are the types of searches you can do with compare. Activity ideas for your students might have them look at two synonyms like big and large or jog and run and then look at the types of collocates that these words occur with and try to generate some rules or some patterns for example, how does large function differently than big when you look at the words in context using the compare function?